Hello there. My name is Niall McMonagall. I'm a retired teacher of English, but once a teacher, always a teacher. And I also write a little weekly art column in the Sunday Independent. And I'm given two minutes, no more, because of Twitter, to talk about a wonderful novel by Christine Dwyer Hickey called The Narrow Land. Ah, Twitter. Edward Hopper is a very, very, very fine artist. And Christine Dwyer Hickey is a very, very, very fine novelist. And the two have come together in this extraordinary book, which tells the story in seven beautiful movements of Michael, a 10-year-old boy, who comes to America as one of Truman's orphans after the war. And he is given a new start in life. And the novel focuses on a summer spent on Cape Cod when Michael spends time with a family and he gets to know Mr. and Mrs. H. Mr. and Mrs. H being Edward and Joe Hopper. It explores the post-traumatic stress of the boy. It explores the tension between Edward and Joe Hopper as a married artistic couple. And it also looks at how Edward Hopper in his work captures all the lonely people, those beautiful lonely interiors and those, those wonderful Cape Cod landscapes. I cannot recommend it enough. The writing is superb, is told in the third person but very often through the observation of Michael and it's a slow unfolding of a really, really deeply satisfying narrative. The Narrow Land by Christine Dwarhickey. You can't go wrong.